Are you ready, kids? Aye, aye, Captain. I can't hear you. Aye, aye, Captain. <gasps> it is hot inside this painting. Oh, who lives in a pineapple under the sea? Lego SpongeBob. Absorbed in yellow and pour as a sea. Lego SpongeBob. If an article not to be something you wish, Lego SpongeBob. Then drop it to Jack and flop like a fish. Lego SpongeBob. Lego SpongeBob. Lego SpongeBob. Lego SpongeBob. Lego SpongeBob. Do 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 do. Oh, today is going to be the greatest. I haven't heard anything from SpongeBob or Patrick all morning. Oh, dang it. Upbeat music started, and you know what that means. Good morning, world, and all will have it. Oh, no, I'm about to trip down my stairs. Ah! Oh, well, Gary, time for breakfast. Oh, no, I'm about to trip into your food bowl. Ah, this tastes gross. Ah! Morning, Patrick. Want to go to the Krusty Krab? Sure! The Krusty Krab is amazing! Krusty Krab! Krusty Krab! Krusty Krab! Krusty Krab! Krusty Krab! Well, you two, shut up! Please, stop yelling! Is that what they have really come to? Making me block my door so they can shut up. Do you hate something so much they made you block your door so they had to shut up? Uh, yeah. Well then, get my earplugs. Which was totally not a reference to my pillow because these are earplugs and that's a pillow. And you won't hear your noisy neighbors. Only one cent. So get my earplugs today. Warning, side effects may include addiction to cracking nut crackers with nuts, addiction to McGrath Productions, your visions of cameras in front of you, visions of sugar plums dancing in your heads, and explosive diarrhea. Bye bye. I need those earplugs! Okay, let's order this. And order. Oh my Neptune! Well, I don't have to say, I never thought I'd be this hampered to see a mail truck. Here it is! Where are my earplugs? Yes! Okay, let's put these babies on! Hold on, I just need to figure this out. Oh. The next day. I couldn't hear him at all. Oh well, I got to work. I would like one crab patty, please. Come on, man. Give the fry cook the order, wouldn't you? Squidward, this guy wants a Krabby Patty. Don't be rude. Give him the order. Thank you, but it doesn't seem like he's listening. I better go talk to your boss. What's going on? Your cashier won't get the fry cook the order. It seems like he's not listening to either me or the sponge. And go talk to him. Mr. Squidward, stop ignoring the customer or you'll be fired. Oh, what's that? I can't hear you. Aye, aye, Captain. SpongeBob. Sorry. I know the problem. Santa? Oopsie, long video. Caleb, I thought you were behind the camera. 
No, no, no. This is Lego caricature me. Real Caleb is behind the camera. Anyway, I wrote in the script that Squidward got earplugs so he wouldn't hear SpongeBob and Patrick. But something that someone else must have wrote in the script was that they backfired and made him not be able to hear anything. That was me. Huh? I am the man in the commercial Squidward saw. I did this so he wouldn't be able to give the orders to your sponge fry cook. And run this restaurant down into the dumps. Because do you know the Krusty Krab Ghoul book? Yeah, which ghoul? Or do you want me to read you the whole book? No, no, no. I know it too. The Krusty Krab's cashier must pass the orders to the fry cook or the rest. Order could not be made until the cashier does so. Thanks to the earplugs, he won't be able to pass the order on or know to take them off. You will run out of business. What happened to this episode being about Squidward? Yeah, this episode really stinks. Can we just end the episode now? Sure, why not? The end. Seriously, what is with this episode? It belongs that makes the episode longer. Uh, I wonder what I missed. Let's watch the episode. Caleb, I thought you were behind the camera. Never mind, I'm gonna turn it off.